Birds are present in every habitat, and even if you don't see them around, their activities still have a heavy impact on the environment they inhabit. These are called ecosystem services, and they fall into four defined categories. The first category is called supporting services. This is required for other ecosystem services to be produced. In here, birds help by nutrient cycling. By spreading activities through different habitats, birds can move nutrients from one place to another. The second category is called provisioning services. In agricultural systems, birds can be beneficial through pest regulation. Through these interactions, humans can save up by not spending money on expensive pesticides and having more productive, healthier livestock. The third category, regulating services, deals with waste decomposition and carbon sequestration. Birds remove the carcasses of dead animals which prevent outbreaks of diseases. They also prevent climate change by taking in carbon instead of allowing it to go up the atmosphere. The final category is called cultural services, which is about the appreciation of nature. This abstract category gives less material benefits. One cultural service is bird watching, which can be used as a source of income for ecotourism. Another is religion, as birds are often considered as symbols or holy beings that play a large part in enriching spirituality. By now, you must have realized that birds are actually pretty important for our ecosystem, yet most of us take them for granted. We have even been the cause of several bird species extinctions in the past hundred years, but because of humans' advancement in science and research, we've realized their essential role in our environment and how they depend on us to survive, just as much as how we depend on them.